I've been snorkeling a few places around the Western Hemisphere and I've learned just enough to know that good gear and good locations make all the difference. Just recently I had the chance to try out the CV-180 snorkeling mask from Wildhorn Outfitters. The CV-180 is a totally different type of snorkel mask. The mask fits around your entire face. It covers your eyes, nose, and mouth. I've experienced snorkeling in the Gulf of Mexico, off deserted island in South America, and having just returned from Nicaragua and Costa Rica, I felt like I wanted my own gear that fits just right and works just right every single time. So after having kept my eye on it for a while, I finally ordered the Wildhorn Outfitters CV-180. Over the last few months, I tried out a few different products from Wildhorn Outfitters and I've walked away impressed every time, and this time was no different. After trying this mask, I did have one big regret, and that was not ordering the mask a few months ago. I really wish I could have had it when I was in Central America. Here's why. First, visibility. It's not easy to describe how amazing the visibility is in this mask. It's a completely different visual experience than any other snorkel equipment I've used. Second, breathing. With this mask, the breathing experience is really different. Like I said, it covers your nose and mouth. Now, I'm not worried about breathing at all when I'm wearing this mask, which is kind of weird. Usually when I'm snorkeling, I have to think about how I breathe through my mouth and not my nose. I got to keep a tight seal with the mouthpiece that I'm biting onto. And I got to make sure I don't breathe in too late after going and diving under the water. And with this mask, I feel so much more comfortable and normal. The mask covers your whole face so you can breathe out of your mouth or your nose. Also, if you try to breathe in while you're submerged, no water actually comes into your mask. You feel the pull of trying to breathe and air not coming, but that's about it. Also, if you do get water in your mask, there's a small valve that when you stand up and your head comes out of the water, the water drains right out the bottom of the mask. Next, when it came to fog, I was a little worried about it. When I tried the mask on at home after I bought it, it seemed to fog up a little bit after I wore it for a little while. But when I took it to the water, I had absolutely zero issues with fog. I was planning on purchasing some anti-fog spray, but now I'm going to wait and see if I need it later on. Next, there's a GoPro mount built right into the top of the mask. You can easily slap a GoPro on there, which is nice. When I've been snorkeling, I've tried different wrist mounts, chest mounts, head mounts, a couple different things, but I'm always worried and fiddling with the equipment to try to make sure I'm filming what I want. With this mount, I know it's facing the right way. I can angle, I can adjust the angle on the fly. I can just reach up and angle it up, down, however I need to. It's really, really easy to use. Um, I feel like I'm always gonna get the right shot. It's quick and it's easy. Overall, that's, that's the summary of this mask. It's quick, it's easy to use, it's fantastic. I got used to it so quick, and I think it's easy enough that my young daughters would love to have masks of their own. Overall, if you snorkel regularly, or if you're thinking of picking up equipment for your first snorkel adventure, I really can't recommend this mask more highly. I cannot wait to use it again. I'm really excited to bring it on my next adventure to Belize. This is Chef. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like, comment on this video, and share it with your friends. It really helps out.